Hello everyone, today we meet again for a video a little special. We are on the PTR server which I remind you is a test server, what we will see here may change before being broadcast on the official server, do not forget to like the video, share it and subscribe to the channel, do not hesitate to give your opinion on the update, I will pass the message to the developers. So today we are going to talk about the returning heroes. The developers have planned some small changes for them. At the moment to unlock Daryl or Wacko's resonance with a gold hero you had to spend 100 fragments of Daryl or Wacko. Then you had to spend another 50 fragments each time you wanted to change your link with another gold hero. After the update, you won't have to pay a single fragment to change the resonance of a hero. This can be pretty cool for people like me who want to test the resonance with each hero generation. You also don't have to pay the 100 fragments to resonate with a gold hero. But now you will need to spend fragments to increase the rank of your resonant hero. As you can see right here, heroes now have a resonance level. If you have already unlocked resonance with gold heroes, your resonance level will automatically be raised to level 4. It looks like there are 7 levels of resonance, but I don't think it will end there. Resonant heroes will also have a special ability that will improve as you increase their level. For Daryl, these skills allow you to increase your deployment speed in all conditions, whether it is to attack other players, infected or buildings like the capital. There is no land limit, so this bonus will be effective also in grey areas. For Wacko, his skills allow to increase the attack of these troops, so it is the infantry in his case. The limit is that the attack is made on an enemy non-player. We don't know yet if this means that it will only marching on infected or on events like underground shadow exploration. Maybe it means that it won't marching on direct attacks, HQ or farm for example. But maybe it will work on building attacks. We will have to wait and see. The main problem with this update is that the value of the retained stats is the stats that Daryl or Wacko will take from the hero he is linked to. For example, at level 0, he only gets 5% back. This means that if you link Daryl level 0 to Grim Maximized so with 708% attack, Daryl will have 35.4% attack bonus. You will need level 4 to get 100% retained stats. So you will need 150 fragments to get level 4. Or you can have already done a reset with a legendary hero before the update. Which is the same number of fragments. We don't know if the other resonances will be compensated by the developers. As you can see on the chart, the skill improves as you improve the level of resonance. This is our forecast table for Wacko and Daryl. They are likely to have errors, the information comes from the PTR and from assumptions. We hope to answer all your questions soon. We are still waiting for some answers from the developers. Thanks everyone, and see you soon for a new video.